Hello everyone, well here's something we say every day of the week, don't we? It's a beautiful day for football in Manchester at the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And with kickoff just moments away, we really should be in for a magnificent occasion. It is Manchester City and they face Al Nasser. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Starting 11 for Manchester City. Emerson begins in goal. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. This should be one to savour. Manchester City get the contest underway. Ake. Erling Haaland. It's with Gundogan. Gundogan. Haaland! An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post, but I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Grealish. Options in the centre. And the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Anderson Taliska. He's got the right idea with that pass. It just needs to remain icy cool. Oh, a smart stop. So the corner played into the box. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Anderson Taliska. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Kevin De Bruyne. Might be a chance here. Keeper dealt with it. <laughs> Going short. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Short corner taken. Grealish. And back with Gundogan. Holland. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Surely! And a goal it is for Manchester City. They are the team on course for victory. Oh, 
Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Anderson Taliska. And they find a gap in the defence. They just couldn't play that decisive ball. Grealish. Holland. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Anderson Taliska. Al Ganam. No, high quality defending. Al Khaybari. It's with Anderson Tariska. Ronaldo. Ronaldo! And there it is! Still life left in this game, and they have the momentum now. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top class goal. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2 1 currently. Rodri. Gundogan. De Bruyne now. Foden. Holland. Oh, did so well to deny him. Trying to pick out a teammate. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Well, what a great save that was to keep them in this. May just be the impetus they need, as they certainly haven't been at their best today. Well, maybe a chance for them now to alleviate the pressure. Well, let's take another look. It's a really well-timed pass to break the offside line. And Ronaldo made the finish look so easy, as he so often does. It's a lovely goal. So back underway, dead level, 2-2. Ake. It's with Gundogan. And he saw the situation developing. How can they create something? Oh, but he's done brilliantly to cut it out. Ronaldo. Walker. Phil Foden now. De Bruyne. And possession given away. Holland. Gundogan must take the lead here. He's fought. Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted. Well, this is a big moment and don't these fans know it. Who's going to get on the end of it? And cleared off the line. And so the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at the Etihad. Well, there's a reason why we're hot. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Ronaldo. Well, terrific defending to stop them progressing. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Holland. 
And he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Will this corner bear fruit for them? Playing it in. Going to struggle to get it away properly. And he takes on the shot. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. And Manchester City will go to their bench. The high press was very much on. Mares and a very good challenge. Luis Gustavo. Plenty of support here. Anderson Tavisca. Now just the tackle that was needed. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. And quite simply, wide of the target. A change in the offing for City. Number 20, Bernardo Silva. Rodri. Bernardo Silva. Ake has it. Mares. De Bruyne now. Rodri. Precise ball movement. Mares. Ake. Well, they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Well, it wasn't a simple save to make. And over it comes. Well, full marks to him for that header, but the goalkeeper did his job. So now a corner. Not all that convincing defensively. And not an attempt he'll be terribly proud of. Martinez. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Walker. Well, as you can see, City have dominated possession in the last 15 minutes. You sense it's inevitable the goal will come. It'll be certainly no less than they deserve. They just need to be a bit more clinical in that final third now. 20 minutes to go. Anderson Tavisca. Bad pass. He has teammates around him. Promising attack, but his timing was off. And a substitution in the offing. Number five, John Stones. Sloppy there, Bernardo Silva. And City get the throw in. Mares. Chance to cross. Holland must take the lead here, and they have, you've got to say, it has been coming. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Martinez. And return to Ronaldo. Not high quality defending.
10 minutes to go then it'll shortly be full time and the visitors have the work cut out for them Stuart. oh big moment here Derek oh what a great save to keep them in front well he's just about won them the game here great Scott well they are committed to making the substitution here Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, there's no way to escape the verdict that that was an awful corner. Silva. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving because it's still close. Bernardo Silva losing out to his opponent. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Oh, he's through here. A goal! Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. Ronaldo in with a chance. And the goal disallowed. You can see why. Offside, Stuart. Yeah, and I think he knew as well. Immediately looked over his shoulder to check for the linesman. And that is that. The 90 minutes have come and gone. Neither side holds the advantage. Now it is all about the penalty shootout. Oh! He had to score, and he does. And he steps up to take the shot. And the keeper makes the all-important save. What a big moment. Well, straight at the goalkeeper. Oh, he saved it. As straight as an arrow. So much pressure. If he fails to score, they lose. And he's beaten the keeper. A goal now, and his team will prevail. And that, alas, went horribly wrong. Penalty saved! And that's the end of the story! Well, that's a good save, isn't it? He's just won the game for his team here. Brilliant stuff from the keeper. Well, no getting away from it. The real catalyst for his side tonight, Cristiano Ronaldo. 
Yeah, he played well, didn't he? So clinical in front of goal, but you have to feel for him. We didn't quite get the same quality from his teammates today, particularly at the back.